I want to show you a quick overview of the UEFI setup utility of the ASHROCK 970 Extreme 3 motherboard. I just upgraded the BIOS to revision 1.8 from 1.2, which is what it came in with when I first bought it early last year. The user interface is a little bit different, although much of the functionality is pretty much the same. When you first enter the setup, you will be presented with a list of tabs that you can select on top. The tabs are Main, OC Tweaker, Advanced, Hardware Monitor, Boot, Security, and Exit. The main tab shows the CPU and memory information. You can see here that I use an AMD FX6300 6-core processor. The next tab is the OC Tweaker. You can set the overclock mode to manual to manually change the processor and bus frequency. This motherboard also lets you enable turbo core and APM. You can also manually adjust the multiplier and voltage of the processor. These are the most useful settings for overclockers. You use the DRAM timing configuration to overclock your memory. There is a wide range of DRAM frequency that you can experiment with. Use the DRAM timing control to change the timing settings of your memory. The most common ones are the TCL, TRCD, TRP, TRAS, and the command rate of your memory. You can exit the DRAM timing control to go back to the main OC tweaker screen. Under voltage configuration, you can choose the DRAM voltage from a drop down menu. You can also change the voltage for the Northbridge, Hypertransport, and others. Here you can save or load overclock settings that you've used before. Under the Advanced tab, you can change the CPU configuration, Northbridge configuration, Southbridge configuration, Storage configuration, Super I.O. Configuration ACPI Configuration USB Configuration You can use the Instant Flash to upgrade your BIOS. Use the Hardware Monitor tab to monitor the temperature and to adjust the behavior of your fans. Use the boot tab to change the priority of your boot devices and to change various boot settings. Use the security tab to change your admin and user passwords and the exit tab to save or discard your changes.